Hi everybody and welcome back to Dundee Goals. I wanted to apologize for vanishing for four months. <laughs> Obviously I fell off the bandwagon and I didn't really stick to the total body challenge as best as I thought I was. But um, that was because I was living in a cloud, a very big foggy cloud. Um, my, my apartment was just really bad for my, my mental state, my old apartment. It was dark and it was cold. So basically like living in a cave for a year. And, um, you know, if you're living in a cave with no light and you're always cold, then, you know, it's gonna, it's gonna weigh you down a little bit. You're gonna feel all sad and hermit-like. And that's how it ended up. I made it seven weeks, so there's the hassle further than I originally anticipated. It was just hard to keep myself motivated when I felt sad and tired all the time. And with that mindset of not really feeling the greatest all the time, and then trying very hard to get your body in a place that doesn't make you hate yourself so much is, is a hard, it's a hard thing to put on yourself. And uh, I, I really just kind of set myself up for failure there. And um, so I, I kind of lost my way and I, I, I stopped doing the program. Um, I didn't see a point since I wasn't making any form of progress in any kind of way. And it was very discouraging. And I didn't really have a support team to, you know, keep me motivated and, and tell me that, you know, things are going to be okay. And if I, I am my own motivator and I am not feeling the greatest, I'm going to be the lousiest motivator there ever is. So in December, I moved to a new apartment. Welcome. <laughs> and, uh, we have a lot more natural light in here. It's just all around a better place. And after a few weeks of being here, I already feel better, feel happier, and was ready to get back into it. But I'm not going to continue with the Total Body Challenge. I wanted to take a step back and do it right. Instead of trying to jump in all gung-ho doing zero to 60 from doing no exercise at all to doing trying to force myself to do six days a week was too much entirely too much but my brother agreed to do one of the programs with me so i wanted to instead of dial it back and instead of doing the 15 30 45s we are going to work through the trim core challenge together and this one is just 15 minutes, three days a week. So no 15, 30, 45, it's just 15, 15, 15. Figure that's a, a good place to start. I weighed myself this morning. That was not fun, especially when uh, I looked at where I started back in July. Back in July, I weighed myself and I started the whole weight loss program at uh, 160.5 pounds. I weighed myself this morning and I am 167.1. So I've uh, managed to go in the complete opposite direction. That's no fun for me. But um, that's where I'm starting now. And hopefully with just dialing it back to three easy workouts of just 15 minutes, not trying to push it to 30s and 45s because clearly I wasn't ready for that. And also having my brother be in my support team, I think this would be a much better place for me to set myself up for success the second time. <laughs> and uh, I um, recently 
created an Instagram account for easier, quick updates. It's at Bendy underscore goals. If y'all want to follow me at all, um, I figure quick updates is a lot easier than trying to make a video every time I have some form of an update. It being much easier on me to try to do that, but Sorry again for, for the absence. I'll try to be better. And now that I have a renewed motivation and I have a workout partner with my brother, I think, I think this, this is going to be good. It's going to be good. Mm -hmm. Follow me on Instagram, I guess. Uh, like, comment on this video. I missed you guys. I'm sorry, <laughs> but uh, Happy New Year, and um, you'll hear from me soon, I promise, okay? Have a great rest of your week, happy January, hopefully new things and better things are going to happen this year, hopefully, but uh, I'll see you next time, bye guys.